Oh, what's up, people? So, quick update on the knee. Currently, um, this is what it looks like, I guess. This thing is fat. The video is not doing it justice. This thing, I don't even know what this is, but it's like really hard. I can't feel anything. There's my foot. There's my crutch. I played it in a sense A feel of discontent I finally facing it all Fearless What's up, losers? Alright, this is vlog number four Um, If you guys didn't know uh, there, I have some big news. I tore my meniscus. I fucking tore my meniscus. <laughs> yep. Uh, right now, I'm able to walk, which is sick. I wasn't a little bit ago, though. I was on crutches for a while. But, um, I said that in my last video. You guys should go check it out. My supplement video is pretty dope. I have to go to the chiropractor, and I also recorded some footage from my surgery you guys can see you can see me a little bit uh doped up off some anesthesia i just finished surgery my voice sounds like shit because they don't let me drink water and me in the the surgery room because i got a little bit of footage it's not much but um yeah i hope you guys enjoy i'm gonna go to the chiropractor once i get back we're gonna hit chest i'm gonna make sure to record all of it so be ready for that. Um, I'm still a little bit on anesthesia. Um, and hold up. I don't even think I told you guys what I did, but uh, I tore I tore my meniscus. So, yeah. But that's gonna conclude the surgery portion of this video. Uh. The surgery went well. Uh, they said it was even better. Or like it wasn't as bad as they they even expected, which is good. Um, I'm gonna be on crutches for a couple days. But recovery time is looking great. So yeah, that was my surgery. Uh... Oh, guys, uh, we're outside again. I just got back from the Cairo. Hope you guys enjoyed the surgery footage. I know it's not much, but I just thought I'd share it for the vlog. Um, we're gonna go in the home gym. It's right here. It's just this garage right here. Uh, I'll, I'll show you guys the home gym and then we'll get right to the workout. And we're in here. I got the bandana on. Always gotta wear the bandana for a good workout. Um, I'll give you guys a quick tour, but first it is really cold in here. So I'm gonna set up a heater. We have a little heater. I'm gonna set it up. So let's do the tour. What should I start off with? It's nothing pretty, nothing amazing. We got some mirrors, um, but to give you guys a little bit of a tour, uh, over here, we got the heater and some other shit. That's not even workout related. We got the dumbbell rack. It goes up to 65. Then uh, we got where we do all the main stuff. The cable and bench press and squat rack and pull up shit. It's, it's, it's pretty sick. We've got like everything you need. And since Corona's here, gyms, just aren't crazy right now. They're not the thing going on right now. So the home gym comes in clutch and to all my people out there that can't go to the gym, I, I know I'm very privileged to have this equipment and I will make sure to upload videos to you guys using it because I don't want to take it for granted. But we're gonna get into a sick chest workout. And before I do that though, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm taking workout right here creatine got the water we're going to take creatine first if the 
this shit would come out. I half scooped my pre-workout just so I can drink more water. <laughs> I'm gonna warm up, we'll get right into the chest workout. So stay tuned for that, let's get it. Quick little disclaimer, um, very important thing that I like to do, it helps my workouts a shit ton, um, is warming up. Like I have three warm up sets before I actually start like working out. Um, and also especially with bench or anything involving your shoulders, always warm up, always warm up your shoulders, especially your rotator cuffs, because you do not want to get like a shoulder injury. So make sure you guys do, um, your warm up sets, I suggest like two to three, um, just to get some blood flow in the muscle and stuff like that. Uh, and usually warm ups, like I'd say the rep range should be like 10 to 15. I'm doing 10 with uh, just a plate on each side just to like get some blood flow into my chest so that I can have like enhanced workout, I guess. It enhances my workout personally. So definitely, definitely warm up before you like start lifting and uh, get into your workout, so. Back to the, back to the edit. How heavy is that? Light work in the base on the track on my face in the back Like I'm taking a slap I need a drink but it's straight from the tap And I'm hating the slack Couple miles slide around like the hate in the gaff Please stop talking that trash Cause the vibes in the fun all the way to the back Okay guys, this is Kyle during the workout We're, we're on to uh, our next workout which is incline dumbbell press You want to make sure that, let me move this this is a good incline for, for your chest. Any farther and you're hitting your front delts. You don't want to go that far unless you know you want to work your shoulders. So keeping it at uh, a low incline, if that makes sense, is how you that's going to be the fuck. As you guys can see, like right there. If you want that, uh low incline. Press. All right, guys, that is shit lighting. So Something I just want you guys to know for any of my like people that are like, you know, they don't know how to do the two workouts I just showed. For these, it's all about getting the squeeze and the blood flow in your chest. So if you guys look closely, we have the striations, obviously. Basically, what we're doing with flies, full extension, and you squeeze in. So you can see, all the striations activating. That's basically what we're doing with cable flies. So this, this movement right here, if you go more down, you're activating your lower striations right here. If you're going more up, you're getting these mid and upper. If you go up, it's more up here. So with cable flies and those dumbbell presses I showed you, it's all about getting that squeeze and activating it. Mind muscle connection. So um, remember that when you're doing that exercise. Uh, so yeah, on to the next one. How heavy is that? Light work on the base on the track on my face to the back like I'm taking a 
slap I need a drink, but it's straight from the tap And I'm hating the slack Couple man on the round like the hate in the gaff Please stop talking that trash Cause the vibes in the fun all the way to the back good chest day i got a little distracted this is a new style of video so uh hopefully hopefully it goes well with the edits we got pretty good triceps this is how you get volume in in your chest in your tricep chest is obviously i got the credentials guys i got the credentials tricep chest we got it all crab claw you know what i'm talking about um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I sure enjoyed filming it. Let's get a quick back check. Wait, there we go. Look at that back. Look at that back. Anyway, um, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'll see you guys on the flip side. Man, I shouldn't have ended it that quickly. I feel like there's something I'm missing. Oh, yo, 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 yo. Subscribe, like, turn on bell notifications. And yeah, we better be growing. I want to hit 100 subscribers, guys. Let's make that happen. Come on. Like, I'm, I'm working hard out here. But anyway, guys, peace out. Stay tuned for more. Hey, sheesh.